Today, a message from two of the Palmetto State's law enforcement officials about National Drug Take Back Day. This afternoon, Attorney General Alan Wilson and Richland County Sheriff Leon Lott held a news conference to share details about the event. This year is the 20th year for Drug Take Back Day. The Drug Enforcement Administration, DEA, holds these events twice a year at locations across the country. Organizers are encouraging everyone to bring expired, unused, or unwanted prescription drugs to drop off locations to make sure that these medicines are disposed of correctly. Well, it can save people's lives. Uh, we've seen an increase of people dying from a uh, overdose of drugs, and these are a lot of them are prescription drugs that they get their hands on. So this is a way that you, know, you can get rid of those drugs that you don't need anymore. The front line of defense is is the the people who are using the drugs uh, and, and most importantly when you're finished using the drug you don't want to keep it around what we have learned is is that a lot of uh, I think 80 percent of heroin users who are addicts basically went through the gateway of using prescription drugs officials say during the event last October South Carolinians dropped off more than 11,000 pounds of prescription drugs at 71 sites statewide